I'm Anna Olson, and you're in the mix with Food Network Canada. We are fully in the holiday season now, and holiday baking is a favorite tradition of mine. And when you share a bite of something delicious and delectable, it really is like giving the gift of bliss. Today, we're making Lindor truffle shortbread cookies. They're really simple to make, but when you gift them, oh, how decadent. So I start by creaming my unsalted butter. It's at room temperature. This fluffs up the butter, and it really helps you get a really melt-in-your-mouth texture to these shortbread cookies. Now I'll add my icing, sugar, and vanilla. This is a simple step, but it's actually very important that you beat your butter and icing sugar very, very well. This is what gives your cookies structure so that your shortbread holds together. And you can add your dry ingredients all at once. Flour, cornstarch, and a little salt. And you mix this just until the dough comes together. Now it's time to portion the cookies. And you want to leave a little space in between them. The cookies will spread. They take about 20 minutes to bake. And now for the main attraction. Unwrap a Lindor truffle, cut it in half, and then freeze your truffles while your cookies bake. Oh, I just love the smell of shortbread baking, especially around the holiday season. That butter is divine, but I'm not done yet. The finishing touch is to top each warm cookie with a frozen truffle. It just melts the slightest bit and sticks on top of the cookie. Absolute heaven. The cookies are ready to pack up for gifting, and you know, they'll keep for over a week. You can even package them in your Lindor Teddy Tin. Of course, if you're really pressed for time, you can give the gift of a box of Lindor truffles. Who wouldn't love that? I hope you enjoyed baking this gift of bliss with me and that you'll share it with someone special. I'll see you next time on In The Mix with Food Network Canada. Presented in part by Lindor.